So first on the agenda this morning is Paraton, an Intamin Megalite. I don't think I've ridden a Megalite before, but you know how much I love Intamin roller coasters. So really excited to get on this one. I'm expecting a bit of airtime, and uh, these are old style Intamin trains. So I think kind of Millennium 40 vibes. Let's do it. That's some quite cool little pirate theming around here as well. Well, some good first impressions there of Paratan on the front row. Decent airtime. Uh, obviously, the front, you didn't get the full force of the drop, but I'm hoping a back row next will uh, solve that issue. But yeah, I was pretty impressed with that. It does ride, ride like the older Intamins. It doesn't quite have that modern flair that a lot of the new ones do, but even still, some really good ejector airtime in places. It was still running very smooth for its age. Yeah, really solid. I'm gonna go back and do the back row. Well, back around Paraton, also really good. I think the front was certainly better. I think you got more air time at the front, which is surprising. Although there were a succession of Stengel dives about midway through the course, where at the back you really did get dragged over those hills. But that's a really solid coaster. Obviously, it has aged a little bit when you consider how much Intamin have developed in the last few years with their multi-launch coasters and stuff like that. Their modern trains are so incredible that even pretty good trains like that feel a little substandard in comparison. But for its age, that rides really well. Really enjoyed that. We'll come back for it later. 